Hey guys, welcome. I'm Parshvika. Welcome to the daily vlogs. Now I woke up um, around 9 or 8 30 or something like that, and then I had the breakfast. And it's a beautiful morning over here. Um, the clear blue sky is there, but sun is not that vibrant because a little bit of the clouds is there, but still, it's kind of like a cool, chilly, amazing morning. And I like the vibes and yeah, the beautiful plants, the flowers, and you can see the sun rays now. No, there is a sun ray, so it's kind of like a, clouds are there in between, but still the beautiful sun rays are there. This is a kind of like a noise of one bird, I guess, or an animal or an insect. It's a very typical noise that usually is here. So now this noise gets quiet. Now I want to talk about guys, it's the beginning of the October, uh, it's almost I guess the first week of the October and then the November and December and then we're gonna go end with the 2023. So I need to set the goals for 2024 because 2023 is about to end and 2023 has been really a crazy time. I've been traveling, I started traveling in the June and it's been really crazy. It's like almost more than four months. It's gonna be more than four months that I've been traveling and traveling with the work while working. Some days are amazing. Some days are not that amazing. I'm learning. I'm making mistakes and sometimes I cry. Sometimes I enjoy so much. Sometimes I laugh aloud. It's just part of the process. Everything is part of the process. And one thing I realized that no matter wherever you go, you're gonna take you with you. What I mean is that whatever emotions, whatever feelings, whatever things that you have within yourself, will, you're always going to be there wherever you are going. Because uh, in the beginning, you may go to a new place, you see the new scenery, you were like, wow, this is amazing. Yeah, that's new, that's amazing. But eventually, the things that you have within you will going to come outside. Your feelings, your emotions, your anxiety, whatever you're going through, will going to come and show on your face. And eventually, you have to deal with that. So wherever you're going, you're taking with you you're taking yourself with you, your feelings, your emotions, whatever is there inside of you. It's not going to go away. So if you're trying to run away from a situation just because it's there and within you, then trust me, it won't help you in the longer run because those emotions will eventually going to come up. Even No matter wherever you are, whatever you are doing, they will come up. They will resurface it because they want to be treated or want to be healed or want it to answer whatever it is. So don't run away from your emotions, your feelings. Try to focus on that. But still, traveling is a great fun. That's what I can say from the past four months. Uh, been traveling and working. And yeah, so I'm going to let you know, guys, what did the day look like for me. I haven't had any plans for the day. Now it's a Wednesday, so obviously I'm going to work a little bit. But still, I have no plans. So we'll figure it out what needs to be done. I'm still waiting for my passport to come from the visa agency. I think it's there in the immigration right now. So no hurries, even if it's come this week or maybe next week. I'm okay with that. I'm comfortable with that. There is no hurry about it. But anyways, I'll let you know, guys, what the day looked like. Yesterday was a really crazy day. I went to the morning market and then uh, I had breakfast uh, and then I had a lunch and I met someone, an Italian grandmother, an Italian old lady. We cooked the food together. It was really nice. It was really amazing. It was in the lunch. We had a we had a lunch together and then at the dinner as well, we had the salads. And it was really amazing. It feels like a family while traveling. That was such an amazing experience. She's still here. She's going to be leaving tomorrow. But it's amazing to have someone while you're traveling especially if he or she is elder than you and they treat you like a family your son that's amazing so yeah i'll let you know guys what the whole day look like and i'll gonna film you know guys so yeah so while this beautiful morning okay guys i took a shower and i almost get ready with this cool earrings that i've never here let's see what i'm gonna be eating i think i have some fruits and vegetables so i guess i'm gonna prepare them and we're gonna eat uh, with the italian lady that i met here in bali so we're gonna be doing that and i'll let you know guys what it's gonna look like if i'm going out or i'm not going out and where, what i'm preparing for dinner and all. so i'm kind of like going out to get some noodles because we're gonna have a huge dinner with the three people the noodles the veggies the fruits and the ice cream and all that amazing thing so i'm gonna go get some noodles and i'm pretty excited for this dinner because that's the last day we're gonna have it then she's gonna leave it so yeah
is nothing. We added too much, so you have to eat now. No, no, no. It's too much for me. More, eh? Because she doesn't, she doesn't want to eat this tomorrow. Oh, no, uh, I, 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 I'm food this tomorrow because the tomorrow it won't be it will look like it won't be nice. Yeah, we usually don't keep the leftovers unless it's needed to. Soy sauce, no? Yeah. I mean, straight. Yeah, no, no. This no. is for you. I like oyster soup. Yeah. Yeah. We will meet this at Indian wedding. I would love 